Vision is behind the making of runners. Praise the Lord. I'd like to welcome you to today. Today is Friday, the 10th day of May, 2024. And our topic today is ill treatment, a proof of lovelessness. The Bible says, love walketh no ill to his neighbor. Therefore, love is the fulfillment of the law. Romans 10, 13, 10. Thought for the day, any form of ill treatment a person meets out to his neighbor is a proof of bankruptcy of love. Some time ago, a woman called God's servant and her, gave her real life experience. A strange woman took her husband away from her. Her husband began to live with this strange woman. Whenever she called the husband, called his line, it was this strange woman that would pick the call. All the time, she was telling the story the husband had already, as at the time she was telling this story, the husband had already been with this strange woman for about 21 days. One day, the woman called her husband's phone line again, and the strange woman picked as usual. And she asked the strange woman, what are you doing? Is it correct? You are a woman like myself. Why are you taking another person's husband? In response, the strange woman said to her, if you don't beg me, you won't see your husband for the next six months. Yep. This man was quarantined in the strange woman's house as if he was being held hostage by that strange woman. In pain, the woman replied the strange woman, the man in your house is the husband of her youth. They suffered together when they were suffering. You strange woman, where were you? And now you are keeping that man her husband and herself and her children cannot see their father. Can you see the heart of people? The strange woman can be des best described as heartless. She had the guts to keep another man, another woman's husband, starving his wife and children of his love and affection and care. What a loveless generation. The truth is, if the matter of love can be addressed, and people start loving one another, then we would definitely have a better world. Love walketh no ill to his neighbor. Romans 13, 10. Any form of ill treatment that a person meets out to his neighbor is a proof of bankruptcy of love. Crookedness or wickedness only displays the lovelessness that is rooted in the heart. Remember this, that any form of ill treatment that a person meets out to his neighbor is a proof of the bankruptcy of love. What's our assignment today? Number one, make up your mind never to be cruel or ruthless or wicked to your neighbors. And number two, don't do to anyone what you don't want them to do to you. Let's pray. Say after me, Lord, I ask that you take away from me the heart of ruthlessness and wickedness and cruelty. I receive a heart of love and compassion for everyone. Oh Lord, in Jesus' name. Praise the Lord. To receive Jesus as your Lord and Savior in case you want to be born again, you know you've lived in sin and you know that you need the help of God. Simply pray this after me. Say, Lord Jesus, thank you for dying for my sins. I know I need your help. Please forgive me. Come into my life. Be the Lord of my life. Wash away all my sins make me a new person. I'm sorry for anything that I have done out of lovelessness. I receive your help today in Jesus' name. Amen. Praise God. I pray for you and I break the yoke of sin from your life and I ask that the Lord will help you to live a life that pleases Him in Jesus' name. Amen. And before I close, I want to wish you a very happy birthday. As your days are, so shall you strengthen. God cause His face to shine on you and be gracious unto you in Jesus' name. God bless you. Happy birthday.